What's up guys, George here from Zero Peer Productions back with another Skyrim Saturday mod review extravaganza and today for Skyrim Saturday we are taking a look at Become High King of Skyrim. This is a mod that I downloaded a long time ago but never used. But today I figured, you know, it's no time like the present so let's get to it. So to start the quest line you have to go here to the Warrens in Markarth. Can I help you? And you'll be greeted by a brand new character in here. He's over here as you can tell by the uh, fact that he's glowing a little bit. Hello, Sergus. Of the black? Hmm? Uh, you seem out of place. Who are you? Of course I'm out of place. I was just added by that mod you installed. Ah. I represent a shadowy organization that serves to steer the course of history through unconventional means, such as mods. You mean like the, uh, the Dark Brotherhood? N no, no, no. The, the Brotherhood is nothing compared to the organization I serve. They are merely a shadow of their former strength, no longer fit to operate. All right, well... He's not wrong. Have you played the Dark Brotherhood questline? You humor me. We do much more than just assassinations, and our reach is much further. I offer you Skyrim itself. Interesting, don't you think? Uh, you're crazy. Leave me alone. All right, let's do that and just uh, end the mod right here. Nope. All right, I shall take you up on the offer. Good, I have updated your quest journal. One more thing. Our reach is far and wide. For a price, I can have any person you wish killed. Speak to me when you are ready. Uh, one thing that this mod installs is it does contain an ESP for setting uh, everyone so that you can make them not essential. So I can ask him, are you set to essential? No, I am not essential, and that is how life in Skyrim is. You only live once. I am here to make the best of it. Uh, I need you to be essential from now on. All right, that makes sense. Safety first. All right. Uh, so let's take a look at the journal real quick. To wear the Jagged Crown, return to Sergus when you have completed the requirements. Don't worry about the objectives not completing. Yeah, so I did read the um, the mod page. So uh, you'll see here that one of the required things is gain 20 supporters and 50,000 gold. I'm pretty sure I have the 50,000 gold. I need to gain 20 supporters, though. Uh, kill Ulfric and Elisif to force your way into the throne. Ulfric's already dead because I did the, um, the Imperial side of the Civil War. Choose one, marry either Ulfric or Elisif to gain right to the throne, or uh, gain 40 supporters instead of 20 to become the voice of Skyrim's people. So I'm not sure how long it'll take to get the uh, the 20 supporters I need, so if it's not too hard, I'll do the 40 supporters instead of marrying Elisif, seeing as Ulfric's dead and I d I'm not into dudes anyway. So... Let's start down here. Voice of the people. Hello. Don't know anyone here who doesn't have rattles or ataxia. Oh, that's gross. Well, speaking of which, uh, will you support my campaign to be High King? No, that is treasonous talk. All right, well, I should mark her for death then. Until next time. But I won't, because I shall be a kind and just ruler. But seriously, screw that woman who just told me to fuck off. How about you, sir? The Warrens isn't a place for your type. What uh, you will want? you support me? No, that is treasonous talk. All right, well, no one here likes me, so I'm getting the hell out of here. You know what? I'm gonna head to uh, to White Run, I suppose. Also, the um, I'm pretty sure that the quests don't keep track, so it won't tell you. Oh, you have one out of twenty supporters, two out of twenty supporters. I think you just have to keep track of that on your own, unfortunately. Oh, well, it's uh, nighttime, but let's see who. Wants to back my claim to the throne. I mean, I am the Dragonborn. I did save the world, so let's get to it. Hello? Hello, fine patrons. What do you say to me being your king? Ah, hello, my Nord friend. I'm pretty sure he's not gonna... I'm pretty sure he's gonna say no, too. Alright, had a feeling. If it's gonna be grayed out, odds are that means they've, they're gonna say no. Alright, yeah. Okay, never mind. Let's get going again. I think part of it has to do with your relationship to the NPC, and if you have a... Oh no, it's a goddamn vampire. Alright, yep. Alright, will you support my claim to being High King? Aw, oh, damn it. Alright, well now I'm, uh... Well, also, I'm about to die. Damn. I'll focus the vampire... Uh, the gargoyle. Alright, gargoyle dead. How about that vampire over there? How's that going? I don't want to get in here, because I might accidentally kill someone that I'm not supposed to kill. Let me just, let me just scoot over here a little bit. Boop. Alright. Oh, he's running away. What? Oh, I got him. I got him. How about now? Will you support my claim to be High King? 
What do you say? Something? Oh, she's gonna say no. Alright, yeah, no, never mind. I just saved your life, but no. You're the one casts those illusions. Yes. Yes, can you make me High King? That'd be wonderful. So let's see. Are you feeling sick? Uh, oh, I am feeling sick. I should go cure that right now. I can't be a Vampire King now. Ugh, so this might take a while. Alright, yeah, no one wants me to be High King, you would seem. I think it has something to do with your relationship to the NPC. So if you've done, like, a quest for them and you have their... I forget what they call it in Skyrim. Not Renown, but... Maybe it is renown. Uh, then I think they're more likely to back you. I'm pretty sure. You tried mercenary work. Oh, it might suit you. Oh, here we go. Will you support my campaign to be high king? Yes, you deserve to be high king. All right. Okay, so it doesn't track it on the quest mod itself, but it will tell you how many supporters you have. So, one out of twenty. I got a ways to go. I got to try and remember who I've actually helped in the game and who I haven't helped. So I might just cut this all out because this is just going to take forever, and it's just going to be kind of going back and forth to different people. There is a good amount of content in this mod, though, so this will be uh, fun to do. Okay, never mind. He he has nothing to say in regards to me being High King. Uh, will you support my campaign? No, that's treasonous talk. The unfortunate thing is now that I've gotten the yes response, that uh, choice is going to be grayed out no matter what, so... Uh. If you wish to All right. Now, if you'd excuse uh, some of these people are from interesting NPCs, just by the way, so that's why you might not recognize them. Nope, Drew's in a sock. All right, you know what? I'll be back when I have my damn supporters. So it took forever, but I'm finally back, and I finally got the uh, the 40 people to support me that I needed. Hello. I've done what is necessary. Can you make me High King? Good, you have the voice of Skyrim's people. Your new palace is located underground in High Reach Keep. What? If I'm king, why am I underground? Um, High King f commands. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna set this guy. I'm gonna mark him for death. He's gonna get himself killed. Uh, High King commands. Hail, hail, your highness. I order you to. I promote you to. I punish you. Are you essential? I need you to guard me. Uh, I promote you to. Yes, my lord. Noble of Skyrim, citizen of High Reach Keep, hero of Skyrim, ranger of Skyrim, high council member, royal spouse. <laughs> yes, we're married now, by the way. Jarl of... Alright, so let's do citizen of High Reach Keep. I'm honored, my lord. Alright, so now let's head to yes. High Reach uh, Keep and check out my new home. Alright, so... It is right by Solitude. Yep, High Reach Keep. There we go. In theory, you should receive... Whoa, wait, where the hell am I? How did... Alright, so this is High Reach Keep. Where... Where does this exist in the world? Now I'm curious. So this is... Um... Okay, then. <laughs> There's a tunnel that leads to High Reach Keep, wherever the hell that's supposed to be then in the whole grand scheme of things uh in theory i would be you know um residing in the blue palace because i'm pretty sure that's where i mean because solitude is the capital of skyrim i'm pretty sure that the uh the prior king uh king torig i want to say his name was uh resided in the blue palace as well along with you know his wife elise if... that being said i can also understand the idea of the mod author wanting to bring a brand new area into the mix so that you feel like you're accomplishing uh, or gaining something new. And immediately it starts raining during, you know, my my rule as king of my new keep. Wherever it is. Oh, uh, hello, sir. How are you? Ooh, look at my guards. What do you mean, what is it? I'm your king. <clears throat> hmm, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm your king. How do you feel about that? High King commands. Well, no, not really. I don't want to do anything right. to him. Need something? All right. See so, yeah, this does add new uh, NPCs or like new citizens to your game uh, for the sole purpose of being in your city. Why do I have activate Soul Forge? Activate activate Soul Forge. Oh, okay. It, I think this uh, gives you like a a new soul gem every day or something. Uh, this adds all the standing stones here. All right. 
Just taking a look around because I haven't familiarized myself with this area yet, seeing as this is my first time here. Really nice houses, I gotta say. Everyone in High Reach Keep is, is living well, let me tell you. Where does this go? Alright, we are... Wait, did I just... Wait, what? Where the hell did that door put me? Like... Um... That's odd. That's an odd choice to have a door that leads to a trap door that puts me over here. When I was just over there. Alright, that's a... <laughs> was not expecting that. Hello. Go fiddling with any locks around here. You're going to have a real problem. I don't think so, I'm the king. That's right, hail your highness. Um, I order you to... Dance! Yeah! You're fucking right. Dance, stupid guard. Go fiddling with any locks around here and we're gonna have a real big party, alright? Yeah, that's right. You remember that, you are now lord of the dance. I promote you. Alright, just take a look at the mine because... It's all mine. I'm sorry, that was horrible. Okay, so we got... Our goal, gold veins. So is that different from regular gold, then? I don't know. We'll find out. Just taking a look around. Is there anyone here I can boss around? Doesn't seem like it. Um, now nah, I'm going to leave the gold for now. I'm a king. I can't be bothered to mine my own gold. Nuh-uh. I make my own gold my own way. By, you know, ordering peasants to give me their gold because I'm the king. But no, I shall be a benevolent ruler. That's because I'm the king. What do you need? I'm going to give you some orders. Um, oh, well, all right. Oh, yeah, you have the option to kill people with your thum. Essentially how Ulfric was able to more or less... I mean, he didn't kill the king with his thum, but he disarmed him, essentially. Uh, so, yeah, you can kill people on command with your thum. Uh, I can... You, I can order him to, well, I can sentence him to death right here. <laughs> I can get his possessions, he can bow before me, or he can dance again. Yeah! That's right. You dance for your king. This pleases me. Merchants, drop off bin. Alright. We should probably take a look at my castle. Whoa, these uh, pretty, uh, pretty lifelike statues, if I don't say so myself. High reach barracks, alright. High Reach Treasury. I'll go in there a little later. High Reach Castle. Need something? Oh, yes. Hi. You are my bard, correct? Yes. Um. I order you to bow before me. Yeah. That's right. I'm king. Deal with it. Alright, so. Oh, I'm. Got my, uh, Stormcloak banner up there. Alright. That's right. Bow before your king. And his kingly ways. And I'm tired of sitting already. That was- Oh! Really? Okay. Just gonna throw some food around. I see how it is. Alright, so that's the only- Oh, no. I was about to say that's the only room in here, but there's one other room, it would seem. Ooh! This is fancy. Oh! <gasps> Oh, and I have a little... I have a sauna. Ah. Oh, I can conclude my kingly duties with a sauna. And there's a there's a bar. And there's another door here. Alright. I have plenty of mannequins from all my different outfits. I have a forge. Cupboards. Alright. Very nice. I'm liking this castle so far. It's a, it's a uh, castle fit for a king. Because that's me, I'm the king. And you better get used to it, everyone, because uh, I'm in charge now. Took forever to get those 40 people to agree that I should be king, though. And when you think about it, it is kind of funny. It's like, oh yeah, 40 people, that's all you need. Uh, that's... <laughs> you only need 40 people to back you in order to become king of, you know, the entire nation. Yeah, you need to move. You're in my kingly way. Oh, god, he disappeared. Alright, there you are. I'm fine, just, uh, just go about your, uh, bard duties. Oh. Hmm. That door doesn't work. Why put a door there? If the door doesn't work. Stupid door. It is funny, though, because this door doesn't match the door on the inside. They're not the same door, because it's 
it, it's a modified version of, um, oh, I'm using the, uh, well, it's not the Heraldy of the Companions, but it's Ysgrimor's, uh, Battle Axe, I forget its name, but interesting choice of, uh, Heraldy, I suppose. Merchant's Drop Buff Bin, alright. I'm guessing this is the Hall of the Dead. High Reach Catacombs, I was close enough, alright. Uh, this is the High Reach Armory. Wonderful. Okay, so I can get more people to come to my town. I can order my guards around. I know what we're gonna do. I'm High King, so I'm gonna go find someone I don't like and order them, or, you know, sentence them to death on the spot. And I have someone in mind as we speak. So, let's go find them, and we'll be right back. Oh. Hmm. Alright, so... I can't fast travel to anywhere else from this cell. Alright, that's uh, a little bit interesting, so let's step outside, and then we shall find the man that I want to kill, and have him killed. Alright, so, on to Whiterun, to kill the man that I wish death upon. Where is he? Aw, oh, damn it. Is that a vampire? Yeah, that's a vampire. Alright. Ah, uh, bow before your king! Bow before your damn king, you stupid vampire! No vampires in my kingdom! Yeah, I'm the king, I shouldn't have to do this, alright? Ugh, damn it! Get away! You stupid vampire! I said bow before your king! That's right, bow! Alright, yeah, no, I'm so glad no one helped me. Also, this chicken's dead. It's not my fault. Definitely not my fault. How you doing? Alright, so let's wait till morning for, uh, so I can find the person that I wish to kill. Alright, now where is he? Where the hell is he? I'll know him when I see him. The most arrogant man in the world. I wish death upon him. I've never wished harm upon a man such as this one. So where is he? <laughs> he's always in the Cloud District, I know that much, because he's always bragging about it, let me tell you. Now where... Oh! Oh, you don't say. Ulfric shouted the king to death, hmm? Well, it just so happens that I might do the very same thing to someone once I find them. Once... Here you are! Do you get to the Cloud District very often? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you don't. Oh, of course I don't. Is that so? Oh, well, uh, bow before your king. That's right. That's right, I'm your king. I- I punish you. I sentence you to per- Oh, I can force people to permanent force labor in the mines. Uh... Ooh. I can sentence them to fight for their lives. I can sentence you to fight for your life in the arena as a challenger, as a gladiator. Public execution. Look at how scared Nazim is right now. Hmm. You know what? I, I could... I could have him killed publicly. But... Alright. I don't know why I checked to see if he was essential or not. Alright, so... You... Oh, you become my love interest. Or... Fusro Da. Yeah! That's right! That was really satisfying. Hello, how are you? Mm-hmm. Alright, so... I promote you to... Hmm. I promote you to Noble of Skyrim. No worries. You're a great blacksmith. It shall not go unrewarded. Minor lord appointed. Hmm. And now... Hmm. I'm just trying to think of what else I want to do with my kingly powers. Ooh. You! Commander? Mm-hmm. You don't say. I, uh, I promote you. I promote you to Ranger of Skyrim. It is my honor to protect Skyrim. You're damn right it is. Yeah. Ranger appointed. 
You can also start a war with the, uh, with the Thalmor, and that's something I'm gonna do a little later after I finish giving everyone their new duties here in the world. Hmm. So, aside from Nazim, who else do I not like? Oh, hey, Solda, how you doing? It's a fine day with you around. Oh, funny that you say that, huh? Hail! Hail, your highness! I order you to... Become my love interest. Yeah. Alright. She's so happy. Alright. I order you to... Uh, oh, I could also kill her, I suppose. Alright. High King commands. I promote you. Royal spouse. Yay! All right, that. What do you mean that is not my spouse? I just told her she is. Um. I promote you to. Royal spouse. Is she not my? That is not your spouse. What does that mean? Fine. All right. Fine. You know. Never mind. Ooh, I know who, who I'm gonna promote. I know who I'm gonna promote. I'm gonna. Promote the Jarl to, uh, royal council member, and then I'll just replace him with, uh, someone else, I suppose. No, 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 I guess I'll keep him as the Jarl. I'll take his steward and put him on the high council. Yeah. Alright, this is gonna work out perfectly. Alright, so, hello. I serve Jarl Balgruff as steward. Not for much longer. Hail. Hail, your highness. I promote you to High Council Member. Yes, my lord? Yes. Um, lord of Administration. I shall gladly accept the post. I will see you in your palace. Wonderful. I'm just gonna take all of his people. Alright. Hail! Hail, your highness. I promote you to... Mm, high council member. Yes, my lord? You shall be... Lord Commander. I shall serve you at once, your highness. My steel and sword are yours to command. I'm sorry that I'm Maybe taking everyone. Over your battles, I'm sorry. Also, keep your while your I'm presence. here... Oh, you know what? You know what? How you doing, ma'am? How are you? What is it? Hiking commands. This is an NPC from a uh, from interesting NPCs. Just so you guys know, that way you you're like, I don't recognize this person. Yes, my lord, you shall be a high council member. You shall be high scholar. It is an honor, my lord. I will see you in your palace. That's right, you will. All right, and where are his obnoxious kids? I'm gonna teach them a thing or two about. Manners. I'm sure that you can't cook good sweet rolls in the skeever hole of a city. Hmm, you don't say. Hail, hail, your highness. I punish you. Wait, wait, let's not be hasty about this. I mean, I'm just a spoiled kid. I sentence you to permanent forced labor in the Argol mines. Have mercy, my lord. Oh, that was fast. All right. That's right, you get over there immediately. So I'm sorry about murdering your child. Well, not murdering your child, enslaving your child. I feel a little bad. Not that bad. Ooh. <gasps> oh. You see, I'm just going to take revenge on everyone that I don't like in Skyrim now. This is going to be horrible. But I'm so happy right now. 